No, the episodes are not out of order. I've just completely skipped a day. I was gonna do um, a vlog yesterday and I started filming it, except I ended up really not doing much and it was gonna be like the most boring vlog in the world. But that's why I decided to just cut it out. Anyway, without further ado, here is the Sony RX105. Oh, here it is. I'm most excited about the high frame rate settings that I can use so I can take some silky smooth slow motion and I cannot wait for that. Um, but apart from that, today is going to be exploring Hoi An and also using my Sony RX100 V for the first time. Very exciting. My homestay host has given me a map and given me all of the points that I can go and see and she's letting me use her bike for free, which is really lovely. First impressions of this town is it's really cute. It's really like it seems quite laid back. It just seems like a little beach town. Like just little cafes and restaurants and there's a, there's a beach that's really close and lots of waterways around. So I'm liking it. Looking forward to it so far. of tone and they're like a little bit old but they're also growing like lots of like trees around it and they've got these lanterns hanging like the whole town is really like like instagrammable i hate to even use that word but like it's so hipster this whole town is really really hipster it's really cool though i love it wearing my hat and having my hair out because it's just way too hot. I think it's actually like 35 degrees in the shade and it feels so much hotter in the sun. Oof. So it seems very hipstery in the fact that a lot of the cafes and restaurants are selling like organic food and they've got um, like vegan options and vegetarian options stuff like that. Nothing wrong with that obviously um, but it just seems very like very like modern day uh, Western culture, I guess. Um, and a lot of places have really good coffee, like they've got that big like coffee grinder and roaster and they do it right there in the shop. Um, and like, to be honest, there's so many white people here. It's very, it's very much a touristy town, but I don't care, I really like it. <laughs>
plus for me because it's one of the very few beaches in Asia that I've been to that actually has a shower on the beach to wash off all the sand and salt. Ah, I feel fresh. Oh, I look terrible. <laughs> Here is a massive pro tip for any girls if they go to the beach or something like that and your mascara starts to run under your eyes and you don't really need to wipe it off. Get a little bit of like any kind of lip balm. I've got some purple ointment. Put some under your eyes. Get a tissue. Sony RX105 that I just bought yesterday. So far, I really, really like it. I am in love with slow motion shots, so I've been loving playing around with the 250 frames per second. The main thing that I have an issue with is the record button is so small and it's really flat against the, the casing. So when I just reach around the camera like this to turn it on, it's actually kind of hard to find where the record button is. I guess they did that so you don't press it by accident. I'm sure I will get used to it and when I do, it's gonna be great. But yeah, so far I quite enjoy it. And I like that it just it just gets me that much, that much closer to becoming Sarah Dietschy. I guess we'll find out what the low light conditions are like when the sun goes down completely. This place looks even nicer at night time with all the lanterns lit. The only lighting is from the lanterns or from the stores and it's so pretty. <sighs> fast that autofocus was that was great oh yeah Sony I like you very very much I'm a shiny mess that's all right so I just found this restaurant that it's um, like like buffet like sauteed beef or not beef like chicken pork and they've got like all kinds of salads and rolls and stuff like that and it's like 100% my favorite kind of food ever healthy and lots of meat <laughs> and it's only 10 Australian dollars, so it's crazy cheap. Just gotta say, one, I love Hoi An. Two, I love the Sony RX105. It's wonderful, and I hope that the footage turned out really well for you. So thank you so much for watching. If you like this kind of video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and share it with all your friends in case they're coming to Hoi An or you're coming to Hoi An and you wanna see what it's like. Um, and uh, yeah. I'll see you next time. Bye.